Hey everybody, it's Mike. December 27th. A beautiful, overcast, overcast, gray day. Thought I would venture out and do a quick uh, plein air painting. I'm not more than a mile from my house. Came across this uh, this creek, uh, which is the back door of uh, an industrial park close to my neighborhood. But wow. What a little jewel here. Uh, this is what I'm looking at. I'm thinking uh, this is probably the composition to uh, embrace. But uh, got a couple little sketches I'm going to put together. It's the first one. I'm going to try a portrait view, see how that lays out. But I, I kind of like this. I'm going to keep it uh, simple. It's about 25, 28 degrees out, no shadows, light winds, uh, bearable weather. So let's see what we can put together here. One of the challenges I have, well, I guess all artists have in the winter, is uh, when it's cold, the paint, oil paint's going to stiff it up. So I prepped this palette at home with uh, some cadmium yellow deep uh, yellow ochre light alizarin got a cad red got a cad green cobalt blue light little uh, cobalt uh, deep and uh, I'm sorry ultramarine blue deep and a uh, oxide red uh, with my titanium white so prep that at home I don't have to squeeze tubes out here and uh, just a quick study, six by eight. And uh, let's see if we can bang this out in about a half hour. Just a study. Don't want to get a lot of details and uh, keep it loose and uh, free. So here we go. So I've got a really turpentined down wash here. Of just putting in some darks, putting in the major masses. All I did was mix up a little bit of uh, transparent red and that ultramarine blue, tad bit of the uh, cadmium green, Viridian. So that's what I'm looking at, just getting some of those darks sketched, scratched in there. Again, I want to keep it real loose, real easy. Let's go to the next step now. Well, I've got uh, the paint is starting to stiffen up, so I've got to keep going quick. Uh, just going to block in that distant uh, tree, sky, horizon line. Uh, try to get that, looks like a light blue established right out there where that fallen log is. Uh, again, just kind of indicate where that is and uh, I want to get this this tree up here kind of penciled in a little bit with that vertical tree um, shoreline put in some whites and uh, call this a study I'm gonna try to get some of these uh, light colored this brush in there it's pretty pretty light I look across the way there I'm trying to match up that value. See that coming in right by that fallen tree. Just want to indicate it a little bit. Fix this later. Just kind of get that shoreline feel. Some white on there in a minute. Just gonna put a little bit of that here. Some tad coming in there. A bit over there. I mean, it's good enough for now. I think I'm gonna to put a knife on this to put that snow in.
green in the distance. Just a little bit of that white back there. Bag some of this down. Look at the other side. Let's get the paint on the edge of the knife. And the study is what to indicate we got some snow back here. Let's look at the composition, see if I got some things where I want them to be. Get pretty close here. We got some of that uh, fallen um, grass. And I'm just mixing up a little bit of this yellow ochre. Yeah, I could go with a tad bit of that um, cadmium yellow deep. There is some darks in there too, but again, I just want to indicate, indicate that I've got something going on here. Too red, purple, neutralize it, add some blue. Good enough, gives me some of those dark edges. One here, back here. Over here. foreground that water in fact I like that lighten that purple up put it on this water back here bring in a little bit of this blue See the blue. Just a reminder for me. Just got a little bit of that there. Use the edge of that knife to indicate the, the brush that's going on there. A little bit of overlap. And really this is all we need for right now. If I wanted to spend some time on this, this bright snow, I could, but why? You know, gives me the general feel for what I'm trying to accomplish. So for a study, been here about 35 minutes. That pretty much could do it for what we got. 
work on this in the studio if I'd like to put it into a bigger painting. But uh, for now, it's Mike. Uh, gonna check out. Beautiful gray day here. Just after Christmas. Happy holidays, everybody.